I'm Chris Porter and I'm reviewing the Salewa Alp Trainer Mid GTX boot. Um, I actually ran this boot uh, two years ago, my Nevada muzzleloader hunt. Awesome boot, I love the boot. I think it's really good for you know Utah general hunts, uh, archery hunts, muzzleloader hunts, desert hunts year round. So when the temperatures start to get where you have lows in the like, you know, mid 30s, low 30s, I would transition into a different boot. It is a breathable boot, which is really good in the warmer temperatures, but um, if the wind starts picking up and the temperatures are cooler, it will get through the boot and your feet will get cold. Really mobile boot, gives you some uh, tons of comfort. I, I, I personally, you know, wouldn't take it on a backcountry hunt. It is Gore-Tex, but I wouldn't want to be crossing rivers in it. I'm a guy who likes a, a more of a durable, stiffer boot in a true backcountry hunt. This boot for me is true to size. So I'm a straight 11 and a half in 99% of all shoes out there, street shoes. Nike, I'm an 11 and a half all day long. Uh, this boot, I ordered an 11 and a half and it was perfect. Um, there are some Salewa models, more of the mountaineering boots that I will size up to a, a 12 to give me more room in the toe box. But because this boot gives, I think true to size all day for me. So the specs of this boot, uh, on, on the Go Hunt stiffness scale, we're giving it a two. So it's got some, it's got some good movement there. Uh, one is probably borderline a tennis shoe. So this is real dang close, just smidge stiffer. Uh, really lightweight boot, so the pair is gonna run two pounds, six ounces, which is pretty, pretty kick-ass. The material, it's a suede leather, and then the toe is a polyurethane leather rand toe. So, gives me some real comfort, like if, you, if you, you're not gonna stub your toe. I mean, it is stiff there, and then everything here is real soft and, and comfortable. They have climbing laces for custom fit, so, you know, if you have a real tough pack out, you can really cinch down all the way to the toe right here and make it a really tight fit. Or if you're going uphill, you want a little bit looser, but with the laces going all the way out to your, and your big toe is gonna be right here. So you're gonna have a, a, the first lace right above that first toe. So um, really allows a, a awesome custom fit. The Slewa 3F lacing system. So back in here gives you, you cinch this down right here and it's gonna pull in your heel really good. So I, that's one of the features I like on all the Slewas. Um, it is an uninsulated boot, like we talked about before. I wouldn't run this um, into too cold of temperatures at all. It is Gore-Tex. You know, I'm conservative when it comes to this stuff. I wouldn't want to cross rivers in this thing. I mean, you have this material here, this suede leather that I wouldn't want to get soaking wet. It is a Gore-Tex boot though, and it can get wet. So again, this is the Slewa Alp Trainer Mid GTX. Uh, one of my favorite early season or maybe desert year-round boots. If you have any questions, let us know. Comment in, you know, down below. Like, subscribe. We appreciate the support. And, and we're always here for you. Reach out anytime if you have any questions, concerns, comments. Available now in the Go and Gear Shop.